Hi there, pipe smokers. Old pipe pops here coming at you. I uh, we're back from Myrtle Beach now once again. Uh, kind of a long, grueling trip with my wife's uh, outlaws. I mean, in-laws. Uh, nevertheless, we uh, had a good time, all things considered. Uh, but uh, it was a miserable trip coming back. Had uh, about a five or six hour delay in the plane taking off from Myrtle Beach and I missed our connection in Atlanta. And I uh, had to lay over in a hotel till the next morning. Not a big fan of uh, commercial flying anymore. I uh, think I'll avoid it at all costs from now on. <laughs> Anyways, the highlight of my trip there was uh, I got at the at the uh, advice and uh, suggestion and and uh, of uh, O'Toole rules. He uh, told me about a place called Low Low Country Pipes and Tobacco Store, which is the brick and mortar uh, headquarters or, or store for the smokingpipes.com online uh, deal. And uh, while I was there, I bought me a pipe as a souvenir of the trip. I uh, got me this... Uh, Another Hans Christian Anderson uh, church warden. Got some real pretty green on the top, red sorta. Of. Like it came with uh, came with the uh, alternative uh, short stem as well. I like them church wardens and I like the Stanwells. That's my second one and they're really nice. And uh, the other thing is while uh, while we was there, my uh, my stepson on uh, one of his trips to the Netherlands, he uh, at the behest of my wife picked me up this pipe. The Big Ben. It's a little uh, kind of a nose warmer. Uh, real pretty green, and it's a sitter. So uh, I don't have too many short, small nose warmer type pipes, and uh, this will come in real handy. Real nice, real nice pipe. He also got me this uh, ceramic pipe ashtray. With the cork knocker, and that's nice for setting your pipe on to cool down when it gets too hot. So, uh, not kind of a nice haul. Also picked up some tobacco. That that store is a pipe smoker's paradise. If I lived close there, I'm afraid I'd be there every two weeks because they have about two thousand two thousand pipes in stock and several hundred uh, tobacco plants. In the jars, uh, I mean, uh, McClellan's and Lane's and uh, McBaron and uh, Cornell and Deal and just about all you can imagine. And you can, you know, have a little test bowl. So uh, try them out. So while I was there, I got me some more 1Q and some RLP6, but I, I picked up some. Uh, Some uh, peaches and cream uh, to try out, and I'm going to tell you what, that'll ghost a pipe in a heartbeat. Uh, I found that out. But I also picked up uh, some more candy. I call this candy tobacco, uh, uh, the, the real flavored ones like that. I picked up some McClellan's Three Cherry, and uh, I know that the wandering recluse and 
and a uh, few others were looking for that perfect cherry blend. Well, I'm not going to say it's perfect, but it's a real nice uh, it's a real nice cherry blend for that occasional smoke where you uh, just want some dessert. <laughs> well, I don't want to carry this on too long. I'm going to make another video in a little bit and address some of the stuff that's been going on on the YouTube. And uh, until that time, uh, I, I'm, I'm still alive and well, and uh, uh, we'll get back to you in a little while. Have a great day, and uh, bye for now.